if she claims she's going to get an added benefit because she has a child that's under the age of majority. Hello, YMYW. Steve from Las Vegas. Someone I know recently turns age 62. She planned to immediately claim Social Security until I explained to her that she would be locking in a permanent 30% Social Security reduction by beginning Social Security so early. I also explained that if one has not reached full Social Security retirement age and continues with employment, Social Security payments are reduced $1 for every $2 of job earnings above a certain threshold. She grosses a bit over $25,000 annually from her casino job, and that's about it. She has no other pensions or assets. However, there is an added complication. She adopted a young child. If a parent's retired and their child is under 18 or under 19 if the child is in school, that child can receive Social Security payments. At this point, we have exceeded the limit of my knowledge. Uh, what do you recommend? Do you recommend a uh, pure financial Social Security analysis for her? I am imagining a female financial planner with children, so my acquaintance and the planner have something in common. Your planner could plug numbers to the Social Security calculator and discuss the results. And of course, the central question is, what age is best for her to quit the casino job and then claim Social Security for herself and apply for Social Security benefits for the child? And maybe there's an option of reducing work hours to part-time and claiming Social Security at the same time she makes that work hours reduction. Thank you. Steve from Las Vegas. Thanks, Steve. All right. So... A lot of moving parts here. She's 62. She can claim the benefits. She works at the casino, makes 25000 bucks a year. Um, it has a child that's in school. What did, did he give the age of the child? I don't think he did. Um, so there's, there's a family maximum in regards to Social Security. So she, if she claims she's going to get an added benefit because she has a child that's under the age of majority. I don't, I, I forget what that age is. Yeah. She says she adopted a young child. So. But yeah. she's in school or something, right. right? Yeah. Probably. Yeah. Probably several years. You're the social security expert. You yeah. Go I have no clue. We should, <laughs> uh, we should introduce her to um, a female CFP here at Pure Financial Advisors and we can do a social security analysis. I don't know. I think, you know, off the cuff um, as a spitball, if she's 62, depending on her age, um, if she's, I, I would claim it because you're going to get that benefit as well. And um, that added benefit at 25, I think what is as a single taxpayer, what is the, the income limitation? Uh, it would be 22,320, 22,000. And so she makes 25,000. So she will receive a little bit of a reduced benefit on her own record just because she makes over that threshold. Um, but it's not going to be that drastic. She does get a 30% haircut on the overall benefit, but she gets it at 62 plus another benefit because of the child. Um, I would absolutely want to run the numbers, but I'm thinking off the cuff, I would take it now just to get the, because she's not going to get the child benefit without her claiming her own record. So, um, we ran analysis like this before, and I think it does make sense for her to claim early. I don't know if it's 62. I don't know how old the child is. So uh, maybe if she waits a year or two, she's going to have in increased record. I mean, increased benefit on her own record. And then so she'll still get the family benefit. So, yeah, I, uh, I don't know, though. I mean, if she you lose one dollar for every two dollars of earnings above the limit, if she's almost three thousand above the limit. Right. She'd lose fifteen hundred. She may not have that much benefit anyway. So you have to run the numbers. We don't we don't know all the numbers, so it's hard to say. Yeah, uh, good point. So find a good CFP female that's got children <laughs> that they could have something to relate to. Sure. Uh, thanks, Steve.